Good morning and welcome to The Breakfast Show. Today we're talking about the beautiful game of football. So if you're a bit of a football enthusiast, then you've probably already played this game. FIFA? 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 FIFA 19. Yeah. So I've played football games since This Is Football 2004, but the first FIFA game I played was FIFA uh, 06. And I think 06 was the best game together with FIFA 10, I think. But oof, those were the days on the PlayStation 2, after school, at 4 o'clock, some gaming, some career modes, no online, no things whatsoever, and ah, it was so much fun. FIFA has changed a lot. We have had FIFA Street, for example, that was a separate game, and that's what I'm talking about right now. FIFA 20 is now introducing Volta, and Volta, I don't know what it means, but it's a FIFA Street mode for FIFA 20, and it looks and sounds awesome. So if you're a bit of a fan of the sports simulating branch, then you've probably also played NBA 2K, there you can customize your player a lot, you have a lot of customization uh, options and that's going to be the same with the Volta thing in FIFA 20, so it's going to be 2K like customization, which is awesome. So Volta will be single player, multiplayer, team play, so with friends probably, um, a story mode and a league mode as well when you, where you can promote and relegate. So uh, it, it looks and sounds awesome and in my opinion I think People are going to buy this game, especially for the Volta, for the FIFA Street Mode. It's so awesome to do tricks on the streets of Amsterdam or on the streets of Paris and hearing the music in the background. I loved FIFA Street, I'm going to love this as well, I think. The Journey, what, what was the Journey again? Is anyone, does anyone play that? No, but I gotta admit, I played the Journey the first time it was out in FIFA 18 and I really loved it, I completely played it. And on FIFA 19 I started, but then I stopped playing FIFA. So I've, I've, I've not played FIFA since about four months or something, because I don't have any time. But I do enjoy it on Nintendo Switch because it's handheld and you don't need to set up your PlayStation, your your screen and all that, and it's, it's, it's a bit of a hassle. So I'm really, and I really, really hope, praise the gods if it's true, that Volta is also coming to the Nintendo Switch, then I can play FIFA Street handheld on my toilet. Ah. Oh. Awesome. So there will be three on three matches or four on four matches with no goalkeeper and there will be four on four and five on five matches with a goalkeeper and you will also be able to play futsal which is the real deal that's not really freestyle but that's um, playing football in a uh, hard pitch and all that. So yeah they're not fixing career mode for anyone asking because I saw a lot of people asking that FIFA had to fix career mode so they're not doing that I'm sorry or they may be add some some small fixes, but no big fixes, otherwise they would, they would say it, of course. But hey, Volta for me is a very big improvement on the previous FIFA games, and I'm actually really looking forward to September 27th, when it's releasing the new FIFA 20 with Volta. Let me know if you're getting this game, especially for the Volta or not, and I hope to see you... Wait, what day is it? Tomorrow. <laughs>